It's the 15th of September. Ooh. And it is one month since I started doing this. So even though this is the fifth episode, it's now completed one month every week. I've been making a video, which is good. So last week was a pretty easy one in terms of like, I didn't set myself too many tasks, but I didn't actually do all of them. I did all my metadata stuff. I did all my sketching things, which is good because they're all things I should be like trying to do most days. My sketching is still so bad. But um, I went to Edinburgh to see my friend, which was amazing. We had such a nice time. It was so good to catch up. I hadn't seen him in about seven years. And then before that, it'd been a few years. So it was nice. Sometimes when you meet with friends you haven't seen in a long time, it can be a bit weird at first, but like then with other people, you just sort of slip immediately back into what you were like the last time you saw you. So it was great. I had such a nice time. We also saw Vin Diesel in Edinburgh singing Flower of Scotland, which is pretty weird. It was a bit of a short week because on Thursday I went up to a wedding in Perthshire. Got back yesterday, that meant a few things kind of went out the window so there was obviously lots of drinking and lots of food that definitely wasn't vegan. But you know, I can I can deal with that, that's fine. Um, I'm, I'm fine with who I am as a human being. I started my plum thing like 10 minutes ago so keeping it straight down to the wire, but I didn't. I just didn't have time to do it at any other point. The thing I haven't really had time to do, or didn't do, make time to do, was to go swimming and go to the gym. It's still early-ish on Sunday, so I might still do that, but um, yeah, that is a, an official failure of a task I was supposed to complete. That was about it that I, of stuff I had to do last week. It was pretty like, just a lot of kind of social stuff. The key is that if you have a week where you're like not doing all the things or it's a bit out, out with your like normal routine, then that the next week you can just kind of slip back into it. Which brings me straight to next week, which uh, is going to be totally out of my normal routine again. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of things I can actually get done. Now, as I may have mentioned before, my dad broke his arm recently. My stepmom's going on holiday, so I'm going to go and stay with my dad for a week and help him cook and other things. So. I think I'm going to be mainly working from home or going into the office in the mornings and then coming home in the afternoon. Anyway, a lot of TBC stuff. So on that, I don't really want to set myself a lot of tasks for next week in case I basically can't do it. And maybe that's not the best way to live your life, but that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to continue doing my sketching because I can do that anywhere. And um, I'm going to take my hard drive and use the laptop to start working on going through Six months worth of footage. Six months of footage from our big cycling trip where we went from Paris to Athens over six months. I um, It's almost a year since we came back and I have basically not even looked at the footage because that's just who I am. But I think I'll actually have more time to do like gym stuff so I'm going to try and go to the gym again next week. It's really ridiculous when you hear people who go to the gym every day or like three times a week and I can barely do it like once but anyway, these things take time to start a new habit but I am again hoping that I'll be able to do that. And that's about it. I guess there'll still be more like, there'll be some fermentating tasks to finish up but that's all stuff during the week. But yeah, I'm basically not going to be staying at home and won't have access to all my normal stuff. Um, Oh, I'll throw in another one. I've got all my friends' Xboxes and controllers and maybe about like 18 copies of Halo 3 and need to go through this box and sort out all the controllers that are definitely broken, all the Xboxes that are definitely red ringed and then make and compile a list of the stuff that we need to get if we want to start doing 16 player LAN matches again, which, you know, here I am, I'm 30, I like a LAN match. It's, it's, a much better situation than playing online so go to hell Xbox Live and PlayStation Network. Switch is alright but Switch is terrible online. What the fuck Nintendo. Thanks for watching and I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you've been watching then please leave me a comment and a like and let me know about it. I haven't really done much promotion for these videos but I wanted to see if I could actually consistently do it and I have so I might invite more people to watch it but um yeah i'd really appreciate it if you are enjoying these videos to let me know in the comments below and um yeah make sure you subscribe because hopefully i'm gonna have some different types of videos um 
a few more things about camera stuff and if I'm now editing these cycling videos, if you subscribe for cycling videos, well get ready for more cycling videos. <laughs>